Uh, you know, I'm backing up the Rayman today, not only for the fear factor, but just because, like, I, I still want to play Gauntlets. I can't lie. <laughs> this patch, I just want to play Gauntlets. I don't know what it is. But the main thing I'm talking about is Axe. So, you know, as you get the first game. As usual, let me shout out the channel members. Moral Day Walker underscore Ty, Nitrogen Drunk Dog, Mark Brandenburg, Eric's OK, Atomic World, Terminator, Lose Your 420, Beyond, Blackbone, Hammy Janwell, Pokey Sushi, Hayden, Fish Sticks, Little Furky, Tude, Actimo, Raijan, Nova Waffles, Ashmit Singh, Kenji, Jacko, Draco, Equus, Controller, Mods, No Glory, Romeo's, Pickles, Mexicano, and Colorful Alchemy. Thank you all so much. It, it's ridiculous. I mean, it, it, the list is going to be covering the screen soon. One of these days. It, yeah. Sincerely, thank you. It helps support me and the channel a lot. Uh, I just don't want to play on this map. I uh, we just got to we just got to see it through. Every time I say that about a game, it's like it ends up being one of the worst games I've ever played in my life. Like like straight up. Uh, the last time we got this map, I, I didn't leave it. It was that that literal eight minute game as as my first game on against the Queen Knight, just running like just, just straight up running like purposefully running. So let's hope uh, this one goes a bit better. But um, what's I even saying? Oh yeah, just thank you for the channel members and and everyone else. Just subscribe if you want to. I, like every single time I say this, there's at least like one or two people in the comment section being like, "Oh, I actually wasn't sub to you." So just if you want to be sub, make sure you are. You know, uh, and if you don't want to be, you know, make sure YouTube actually hasn't s slipped fucking dimensions, gone gone into some parallel universe where they're actually subbing people without them trying instead of unsubbing people. Then, oh, what a world you would live in if that was the case, man. So I don't know. Whichever one it is, make sure you're either subbed or, or you're unsubbed. You know, I don't, I don't fucking care. Uh, but yeah, um, Axe. That's what I was going to talk about. This shit. Oh, it's it's becoming a, a bit insane. Um, like, Okay, the thing with this weapon, right, is I don't ever think it was bad. I don't think Axe was ever a like, It's just... You're seeing this. This shit is guaranteed now. Like, ah. Okay, because there was that heavy weapon meta, right? Which we all know, I'm sure. Like I said, it was, it's the most recognizable meta. I think these days anyway, because you know, everyone was around for that. It, it wasn't too long ago. Um, and all like the current top pros were kind of, I don't know. A lot of them came from that matter even. Uh, but yeah, I think people associate that too much with like the wrong weapons. Because Hammer was the real fucking like killer back then. Like Axe, of course, was, was getting played all the time. But a lot of Axe was Teros, which was also Hammer, you know? Um, I don't know. I, like the weapon, it got nerfed. Of course it did. Because uh, it was like, it was very strong. It deserved nerfs and it got nerfed. But it did not get nerfed nearly as badly as Hammer did. I mean, look, Hammer is still shit. You know, it, it's, it's received countless buffs to try and make it like somewhat usable again. They can't. That's how badly they nerfed it is, is the weapon after like four patches in a row of buffs is still ass. You know? Uh, and like, I'm not even exaggerating. The weapon is actually just straight up not good. Axe though, I don't think it ever became bad. It got nerfs to some things. But it was never like crazy. You know? And now they're just buffing it patch after patch. Like, I don't think it needs it. The weapon is fucking strong, to be honest. Oh, I nearly died. I didn't have a jump. I don't know where the fuck my jump went. Sucked. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, at least you had three exclamation marks. I still didn't kill him. Yeah. I mean, you should know that's coming. Abuse player in this patch. Let's see how nerfed the weapon actually got. I can't lie, I've not fought any beats player since, since the update. I've also not played ranked, so I mean, it makes sense. Um, what was I even going to say? Oh, yeah, I think Axe is just one of those situations where it's like, the weapon wasn't bad. I hate that end light so much. I hate how it, like, pushes them back. Like, you're always just in the wrong place to punish it. Look, it, ah, it's fucking annoying. Anyway, um, yeah, I don't think the weapon was ever bad. I think it, it, it was just underplayed just because people weren't playing it, if that makes sense. Like, I don't think it was underplayed because it was a bad weapon. But, I, like, you know, there, there aren't a lot of Axe players, so it makes sense why you would, like, buff it. Like, I'm not even going to, you know, say anything like that. Um, like, it does make sense. But at the same time, buffing axes is a fucking dangerous move because, like I said, I, I think the weapon is already good and they're buffing the thing. Like, they're giving it three piece two combos on some maps. Like, like no exaggeration. It, it literally has... If it, well, I mean, it's very, it's very situational, so I'm not even going to speak on it. But, you know, more importantly, with that change and what I think they were trying to accomplish with that change was that you can get... And you saw me do it a couple times last game, but um, you can get fucking side light, nair, GCD light. This guaranteed if they have no dodge like let's say you, you catch a spot dodge like i did there he had a dodge i just just didn't fucking choose to use it but if you do catch like a, a, a missed gravity cancel or you catch like a spot dodge in the air or something like that then yeah you get that uh oh here we go he's, he's too damaged for it and i fucking missed it anyway um but oh, i thought he jumped i'm dead that doesn't kill oof i mean tesco did get nerfed what the fuck he's gonna like yep yeah. A new RNG fucking random input sig was going to come out right there. Just have to 
Gonna recover. Recover. No. Nope. I'm just gonna like, ground pound and see what happens. It'll kill. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, these hitboxes. But yeah, they gave um. So that's guaranteed. And, and free hits on X, by the way. To, to get free guaranteed hits on X is like to get ten guaranteed hits on Scythe. Well, not actually, but like. Ah, oh, it's just the weapon is good. They give D like less fucking end lag. He's gone. He can't handle it, and he's playing fucking battle boots. Do you know how deep it is? Like, they, they buffed too in the, just this patch in the latest patch because these this is from like a previous patch I'm talking about. But they buffed its best moves. They buffed Dare and D Light. Literally some of Axe's best moves. Probably Axe's best moves, actually. Like, uh, I mean, Adlight is also a very good one. I mean, and Recovery. And Ground Pound, you know, the big 360 hitboxes. But, it, it's crazy. Anyway, next game, because... Yeah, this guy, I mean, I, well, I don't even have to go next to her. I can just kill him. Oh. Okay, don't get too gassed. But, yeah, they buffed Dare by making it, like, more... What's the word I'm looking like, Give it more drift, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, making it more maneuverable. I think that's a word. Yeah, in a way, it definitely is. Um, so it's like now you're okay. If I can actually get axe and show off, that'd be cool. Uh, but you can just throw out dares, and a lot of the time you don't really get punished for it. Like, look, you, like what can you really do? Because you have like so much more drift on it now, um, which is which is insane. Like I said, already axe is one of axe's best moves, you know, by far. Uh, and now you can just kind of dare for free. Look, I mean, he's fucking fighting for his life trying to punish it. I know he's plat, but you know, still. It, yeah, kind of crazy. Uh, I don't think they gave Nair more drift, but no, that's that's fine. For Dare to have more drift is already kind of insane. Like it gives it kind of like the the lance property as well, where if you miss it, you can either stop all your drift or you can keep it going. So it's like you can land on kind of either side of them. Like it's yeah, you can just keep throwing out. I mean, I've done nothing but Dare this entire game, and it's so far I'm prospering. Yep, I, <laughs> I really just don't blame him. And then they also buffed Delight by making it have less end lag, which is crazy. Uh, because that move is already, if you're using D-Light properly, and it, it's such a fucking insane move, like, already. And if you're using it properly, you're not going to get punished by that already, let alone with this buff on top, giving it, you know, to... See, that's what I mean, you can react so much better out of that shit. But look, if he just starts, starts to play a bit floaty, he's playing very grounded right now. Uh, but hopefully I can maybe make him play a bit floaty. No, he's just... He's not going to play floaty with guitars. But like that, right? It's like, if you're up there in that range... What can you actually... You can't punish it because you have to go so far around it to be, like, safe from it that by the time you've gone around it type thing, you're you're out of, like, fucking range to punish. Like, there's no hope of punishing it. Like, the move is insane as an anti-air, right? And, like, the disjoint is massive. So, giving it less end lag is... It's crazy, in all honesty. I mean, all these, these buff stacks are, are kind of crazy because, like I said, I think the weapon is already good. Straight up. Um, I'm seeing some talk... You know, potentially Axe's... Who tweeted it? I think Experience said Axe. Was it Experience? I think there was some pro player, some NA pro player, saying Axe was the best weapon in 1s and 2s. I don't know about 1s. Uh, I probably would, would heavily disagree with 1s. With but 2s, I, I, I mean, the weapon before this patch was already, like, with ease top 3 in 2s, right? Like, it always has been. I don't think there's ever going to be a patch where Axe isn't one of the best 2s weapons. Um... But, like, yeah, it, now it's just even fucking better in that game mode, which is which is insane, uh, really. Like, oh, look at this weapon, man. You just can't say that. Like, <laughs> this is what I mean. Most of the things I'm even hitting, they've not changed. This is just how it's always been. Okay. And, like, drift. Oh, insane. Um, that actually just made me feel a bit ill. How the fuck is that catching? How the... Okay, cool. Let me take that. Um, but yeah, I was going to say something else too. I just fully forgot. Dodge down. Ooh, that would have been nice. Like, ah, look at this weapon. I, oh, I just, it makes me really fucking wish there was an orb axe. I, I really, really fucking want an orb axe engine so badly. I would play that. A hundred percent. Just no words. I always forget you can dodge up out of that fucking sig. I just never do it. And I just get hit by it every single time. There's, there's something about these green lights, man. I, the six band works at any level. Straight up. And then D-Light. He's playing grounded. Just playing the air a little bit. I want to... Oh, okay, I guess not. But yeah, like I said, I think that's literally all I have to talk about. Like, I, I can't even continue to waffle about the weapon. You lot have seen it for yourselves. Like, it is, it's fucking insane, really. Uh, and I wouldn't even be surprised if next patch they just buff it again. Because fuck it, why not? We'll see. Um, well, I was going to actually talk about something today. Oh, I was going to talk about fucking... Okay, I, I have like a like a problem, man. I, for some reason, okay, 
And this happens with like everything. Everything I enjoy. It's like, I, I think, okay, I'm enjoying this thing now. Uh, let's say it's like a, a game or it's, I don't know, an activity or something. And I'm like, I could literally never get bored of this thing. I'm doing this thing every single day. And I already know, like, it's burnout. Like, I mean, that's just, it's, it's a thing that exists. And it's a thing that, that happens to me and to, like, most people. But I just, for me, it's just, like, so bad. Because I literally think I'm doing something. Let's say it's, like, Isaac, okay? I, I, like, that game, um, The Binding of Isaac. I was playing that. Every single day I was playing it, I was thinking, I don't know. Because it, it, it's a game that I quit before. Like, I, I'd played, grinded, and, and quit before. Like, I'd gone through the whole cycle. And I was like, how the fuck did I ever stop playing this game? Like, how the fuck did I ever get bored of it? I could never get bored of this game. And then just all of a sudden, like, I didn't even finish it. I didn't even complete what I was trying to do or anything like that. I, I just one day didn't play it. And then the next day didn't play it. And then the next day didn't play it, you know, and it just, just stopped playing it. And it's like, it happens with Brawl sometimes too. When I'm like practicing, like if I want to actually improve and become good at the game, you know, I'll, I'll try and do that for a little bit. And I'll be like, oh, this is like, this is fun. You know, I, I, I could grind this. Like I'm actually going to grind this time and, and not stop. And then eventually, and this has not happened yet, by the way, because I'm I'm still trying to grind currently. Um, but you know, this has happened before, where it's like, you know, I'm like, yeah, I mean, I could just grind this with ease. You know, I'm I'm not gonna get bored of grinding this. It's not gonna get annoying or anything like that. I'll, I'll be fine. And then I just get bored of grinding it and then stop grinding and then yeah, become worse. And it's like, okay, like this shit just happens to me. With fucking everything. I I don't know. It, it's so annoying to you. Elden Ring. That was another one that I was literally playing every single fucking day. I think I just go in too hard on things, you know, like, like, cause that game within, I don't even know, man, it was, it was not a long period of time, maybe like two, two, three weeks, not even that, I think maybe like two and a half something. I, I'd, I'd fucking completed the game as it well, not, what am I even talking about? I'd not completed the game. I, I meant to say I had like a hundred plus hours in game time, like not just idle act, like, you know, just doing fuck all in the game, like actual playing the game. I had 100 hours in like that short amount of time that's like the most i've ever played a game and i was like the whole time i was playing i was like i can never get bored of this man this is, this is the best game that's ever fucking released and then yeah i just stopped and i to this day i've not completed Elden ring i didn't even i didn't even get to the fucking fire giant and i know you're thinking if you play that game how the fuck did you have a hundred hours in game time and not get to the fire giant i i like obsessively checked every single corner of that fucking map of that game because i didn't want to miss anything like i literally th there's things that I have friends that have played the game like like fucking 10 plus times, completed it 10 plus times, and I'm telling them about things that I saw, and they're like, I had no idea that even existed. And I literally played played it once. I didn't even complete the game. I didn't even honestly get close to completing the game. So it's like, yeah. Why the fuck is everyone just leaving today? I, uh, uh, I'll play one more game, I guess. Or, or can I even be asked? I don't even think I can be asked. I'm just going to smack up the bot real quick, and I'll call it a day, I think, because I just... The second person is going to leave and then I'm going to have to play another game after that. And then, I, I, oh, I cannot input against bots, apparently. Unfortunate. And he's better than me. Cool. Um, but the one thing I'm hoping at the moment that this doesn't happen with, because, um, yeah, the one thing that I'm like, you know, I, I, I'm enjoying the most in life right now is like going to the gym, putting on weight, you know, these things, trying to actually improve myself a little bit. Yeah, I've been going like very consistently, eating very well consistently. When I say well, like I've been eating fucking lots, you know, to try and put some weight on this shit. This bot is just doesn't want to die. And it's like, if I get bored of that and I just stop doing it, like I'm, I'm pissed, but I don't think I can. But then I say that about everything. So it's like, I fully probably could. Oh, it will piss me off. But I just got to make sure I, I don't get into like, I just got to make sure I don't skip a day because I think that's how you would kind of fall into that trap you know you skip one day and then you skip another day and then ggs you, you you fucking cancel your gym membership but like yeah i don't think i could i've not missed a day yet i've been going for like a month and a half or something like that and i've gone every single day well every, not every single day but like every single day i mean to go i, I go four times a week and eating too i've made sure I've, I've gotten enough calories every single day i've not skipped a meal none of that it's like, oh, fuck. I just hope it doesn't, the burnout doesn't happen with this. I don't think it can, because this is like real life. This isn't even like a, like a hobby. But it kind of is a hobby, you know? Like, I, I enjoy my time going to the gym. Ah, I don't even fucking know, man. It'll piss me off, though. If I, I just, yeah, like I said, I just gotta make sure I don't get bored or burn out or whatever. But there's just nothing stopping. Because like I said, every single fucking thing, I think I'll never get burnt out of this. And I could do this forever, you know? And then it just, just, I get burnt out eventually and quit it. 
as a, oh, fuck we'll see anyway you lot let me know if you like feel the same about certain things uh, i mean you probably do i think this happens to everyone i don't really know but it does piss me off until next time though hopefully you lot have enjoyed the video even though every single opponent is fucking disconnected understandably i'm playing rayman you know um and yeah until next time have a good your days i love you all thank you for the support lately um channel members everyone i've even seen super chats some fucking like it's just crazy this is this is the most support i think i've ever got all the comments all the love being shown and, and all that shit. It's just, thank you all. Um, and yeah, like I said, have a great day. I love you all. And peace.